it is a, a great day for Penticton. Provincial Health Minister Adrian Dix led a ceremonial opening of the new Penticton Regional Hospital Tower Friday afternoon, though it won't be operating for another few weeks. It's an extraordinary thing. And um, I believe anyway, as Minister of Health, one of the most extraordinary things about places like this though, is that this care that's provided every day. 84 private rooms, a new MRI machine, a helipad and more are part of the $312.5 million project, named for major donor David Campy. Earlier in the day, Dix announced provincial funding for more doctors in the region. Uh, a significant transformation of primary care that it needs to happen. $4.4 million over three years will go toward 22 new health care workers, including doctors and nurses, in Penticton, Summerland and Okanagan Falls. Many doctors in the South Okanagan Samil Kameen region are retiring. The practices have closed and this has left a lot of people in the region without consistent care. A new clinic in Penticton will open its doors in 2020. The network of healthcare professionals will work together to direct patients to specialty services like mental health and addiction treatment. Even if you have a family doctor now, this is, we're going to expand the hours of operation so it'll be easier to get care in weekends and after hours. That's one thing. And two, you're going to have access to different kinds of care, appropriate care, which is not always the family doctor, although it's not going to change. The family doctor is going to be at the heart of this, of course, as well. Expansion of the program to the rest of the South Okanagan is planned, but has no timeline. Chelsea Powery, Castanet News, Penticton.